Hey guys, welcome to Coffee with Angel. I am Angel. Thanks very much for joining me either on my blog at coffeewithangel.com or on my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to share with you a tip that I learned this week and it was something that sounded so obvious when I heard it, but it's really going to change the way that I speak to people on the phone. And if you aren't making phone calls right now, if you're not doing phone call prospecting, you're not picking up that phone, eventually you're going to because having a successful business does entail picking up the phone. And, and if you're like me back a year ago today, probably I was saying, you know, I won't pick up the phone that I'm going to build my business online and never have to call people. And that just changed. And so as you take training and as you realize, you know, what it takes to, to grow a home business, you will be picking up the phone more. So either if you are, if you aren't, this will help you out. But, you know, I was I was on a webinar for Doug Firebaugh. It's his Monday night webinar. It's called Fuel the Fire. And there's always just so many good tips in there. Doug just always puts things out there and is really real with everything. And he was giving you four tips uh, that you need in, in your business so that you're not making these mistakes on the phone. And he was talking about how he keeps his phone conversations between five to seven minutes, which is awesome. I'm working on that. I'm at about a seven to nine minute uh, time length on my phone calls. So I am working on that. But, but he's just saying that it's got to be to the point. Um, you know, you don't talk too much for sure and, and you want to be asking the right questions and listening and asking and listening and asking and listening. And then he said something that his mentor had told him years ago um, that really affected me. And he said, anything that you say after the decision is made, so if they're saying yes, they're going to join on and they're going to sign on, anything you say after that is an apology. It's in the form of an apology. And I thought, wow, is that ever so true? Because I've been in that situation before where somebody has said that they're going to join on, they're going to sign on, they're ready to do it right away. And you keep talking and you keep saying something. And, and it is, it's in the form of, a, of an apology because... Either you weren't expecting them to join on or you really want them to feel comfortable with it, with their decision, so you keep talking. But So what you want to do, you want to sign them up and you want to stop talking. You don't say anymore. You say, that's great. You take them through the sign-up process and you get off the phone. Send them their training. Set up the next time you're going to talk with them to do their goal setting and to figure out how they're going to work their business and what they want to do. But get off that phone after they've signed up and don't say any more about the business. If they ask questions, you can answer them. But, but your job is done once they've said yes. So I thought that's a huge tip. Hopefully you can go out there and use it in your business. I really appreciate you guys being here. As we go into February, I'm going to be going into branding. I'm going to be doing, I don't know how long, I've got so much training on branding that I can share with you guys and branding is so huge in your business. No matter how you do it, you can brand yourself just on social media. You don't have to start a blog and your own website and really be out there putting yourself out there. But branding is all to do about who you are, what you stand for and why people are going to want to follow you and join you and building that attraction marketing business just based on your own brand. So that's what I'm going to be covering in February. It's going to be a lot of fun. I had a lot of good feedback from the last email that I sent out. If you're not on my email list, you want to be. And one great way to get on my email list right now is to go and grab the seven days of mindset audio that you can uh, grab on my page at coffeewithangel.com. Just enter your name and email and I will send that off to you. And then you'll be on my email list and you will be kept up to date with all of the fantastic tips and training that I share with my list that I don't necessarily always share on my blog. So I appreciate you being here. Have a fantastic day. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.